how do you build an app or an amazing software without the help of a technical co-founder, especially if you don't know how to code or you've never built apps before. Now, for those of you who don't know who I am, I'm Pramod and I built and launched two complex apps in just two months by myself without hiring developers with no technical co-founder and I did it for close to zero dollars. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can do this too, even if you don't know how to code or where to start. Now, I was able to build and launch my applications because of three very specific reasons. The first is low-code tools. When I first heard of low-code tools, I was a bit apprehensive too. Like, I was not sure if they can build enterprise-level, scalable, and maybe even future sellable apps. But boy, was I wrong. The latest low-code tools can do everything. But low-code only gives you the infrastructure to build your apps on. Low-code does not mean no code. So in order to actually go live with your application, you will still need a little bit of coding. And that's where the second tool comes into play. And that is ChatGPT or any of the AI tools out there. You can ask AI to tell you how to design your app, how to build your database tables, how to structure everything. And it will even write the code or the queries required to you know, uh, help your app function better. So now that you have the infrastructure and you have the AI to help you execute on that infrastructure, the third part is the Prometheus framework, which I built by myself. This combines almost 13 years of knowledge working in the SaaS space. I've taken all everything that I've learned and I've created a step-by-step -step framework that allows me to quickly launch apps without you know, spending a lot of time thinking about what needs to be done. Here's the biggest lesson that I learned after building my two applications. The time it takes to build your app is actually very less. Today, I can build any app in about a week. What really takes time is figuring out what you need to build, how to design it, how to structure it, and all of those things. And that's where the framework comes into play and structures everything for me so that I don't have to think, I just have to follow the structure, the blueprint, and I can get my app live. But not just that, I actually recommend people don't get a technical co-founder, especially when they're getting started. Because in my experience, I have noticed that technical co-founders slow down the process of going to market. They are focused on all the wrong things like the technology in which environments to build in. Is it AWS or Azure and the scalability? All of this is unnecessary friction when you're getting started. As a startup founder, you need to be focused on getting your product to market and figuring out what kind of experiences your customers must have in order for them to continue using your product. And all your energy will be focused on that. And if you try to shift your focus from that to the technology, well, you're going to end up not building or you're going to end up building something that people are not going to like. So this is why the combination of local tools, which will help you launch quickly without worrying about the tech, AI, which will help you launch by yourself without the need of too many people in your team, and the Prometheus framework, which will give you step-by-step -step instructions on what do you need to do so that you can go live quickly is so powerful. So if you have a great idea and you want to start building your app, you can get started today. Don't procrastinate. Don't wait for another guy to come and save you. No one is coming. And if you want to do that by yourself, I did a live webinar in January where I explained my process and how I went about learning this domain and building apps by myself. I consolidated the best parts of that video into a one hour video. And the link to that will be in the video description or in the pinned comments go check it out because it will give you the exact first steps you need to take in order to start on this journey. So if you found that helpful, please leave a like and a comment with any other questions that you may have around building SaaS and gaining financial freedom through it. And until we see each other next time, I'm Pramod. Take care.